the Flying Arrow Archery Toxic Broadhead. Um, got some people that have said, and I've seen on Facebook pages, that uh, the Flying Arrow Archery Toxic Broadhead is not accurate. So we're just going to shoot 20 yards and uh, show what we can do. Um, we've got the uh, one of the green toxic there, as you can see, and we've got uh, um, we've got a little special arrow behind it. We'll get to that later. So take a look. Shoot for that white dot down there, about the size of a penny. I don't know how you can get any closer, any tighter. Look at it. <laughs> That's pretty tight. We're going to get some pictures. Man, I just, I don't know how it gets much tighter. I mean, obviously you can get tighter than that. You can uh, knock the fletching off your arrows. You can Robin Hood it, I guess. But, uh, yeah. Look at that. Clean the fletchings off of it completely. Would you look at that? <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah. Who says the flying arrow archer toxic does not fly right, fly straight, accurately? Well, I'm telling you they do. Just tune your bow and you'll be all right. Get these out of here if I can. Look at that. I'll tell you one thing, the Flying Arrow Archery Toxic Broadhead will destroy your targets. Be prepared to spend money on targets. Look at that, would you? <laughs> yeah. Imagine that looks like what that looks like coming into a deer. Yeah. Oh. Pretty nice. Let's get that other one out of there and see if we can pull that one out. <laughs> Talk heard the word meat worm? No. How about foam worms? Target worms. Yeah. Pretty slick. Anyway, y'all have a good day. Thanks for watching.